Welcome to Extreme Web Designs. This is Rocky. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up Google Analytics for your YouTube channel. So let's get started. So visit google.com slash analytics and then once the page loads, click on the sign in link at the right hand corner of the screen and click on analytics option. And then once the page loads, in the left hand sidebar, look for the option that says admin, click on that. And once the property information loads, under the account settings, click on this drop down. And then look for the option that says create new account and click on that. And once you are on the screen, enter the details as mentioned here. So enter an account name. In my case, I am going to enter it as YouTube channel and enter a website name in my case i'm going to again enter youtube channel and under the website url box we need to enter the youtube channel url so let's go get that from our youtube account so simply go to your youtube account and make sure that you log in into your account that you want to link it with this google analytics and then in the left hand sidebar, click on the option that says my channel. Once that navigates to the page, copy the URL that is shown and go to analytics and paste it under the website URL option. Now note that once I click outside, it says that the default URL is invalid. That's because we need to remove the prefix of the protocol from here. So let's do that. All right, now we fixed it. And from the industry category, select the one that is appropriate for your channel. In my case, I'm going to select it as Internet and Telecom. And in the reporting time zone, I'm going to select my timing as Central Time. You can select whatever time zone that you are in. If you're from other countries, you can select it from here. And under the data sharing settings, review the ones that you would like and uncheck the ones that you do not want to be a part of. In my case, I'm going to leave everything as it is. And then I'm going to click the Get Tracking ID button. Read through the terms and services and click on the I accept button over here. And that will create the property. In my case, I'm going to copy the tracking ID for this property and go back to the YouTube account. So now we need to go to the video manager section. So simply click on the video manager link, look at it over here. And once the page loads in the left hand menu bar, click on the channel option. And once again, in the left hand menu bar under the channel option, we have an option that says advanced. Click on that and scroll to the bottom of the screen and paste the Google Analytics tracking ID over here against the label that says Google Analytics property tracking ID. And then click on the save button. And as we can see, the confirmation over here, the changes were saved. And let's scroll to the bottom. And yes, indeed, the changes were saved. So this is how we can link Google Analytics with our YouTube channel. One thing to note over here is that you will not see the data in Analytics as soon as you link it with YouTube. So if you are not seeing any data in your Google Analytics section for this channel, even though you have done everything correctly, Chances are high that pretty much Google needs some time to collect the data and show it to you. So in this case, you can wait for three days and then come back and check your analytics and hopefully you'll find the information that you're looking for. That's it for this video. Hope you guys liked it. If you found this video to be helpful, please feel free to hit the like button, leave a comment, share it on social media and subscribe to the channel. Soon after you subscribe, make sure you tap the bell icon located right next to the subscribe button to receive all future updates. Thanks for watching.